Are you ready? Are you ready for the moon, my friends? You're not ready, but we're going there anyway. Hope you packed your spacesuit. One unfortunate thing is the, the, there's no attempt to model like gravity or anything. Everything has its own visual style, but you know, the movement and stuff. Oh, hey, it's a mola mola. Good fish, very good fish, high quality fisher, you know. Oops, I'm, I'm zooming. You have to zoom with the um, the gyro. You, you hold the button and like move the controller outward. It works, but it's a little weird and sometimes it gets like inverted or something like. I don't think the gyro resets itself like it does in some games. At least it doesn't reset itself very often. But yeah, the moon has this sort of gray aesthetic. And lots of stars and little moon people. This isn't even a very moon- well, there's a moon car. Sometimes there'll be like hordes of moon people and stuff. Which is what I was hoping for. Oh, little robot man! Hey, Mr. Robot Man, how many you? Yeah, little moon cars. Everybody loves the moon cars. Oh, and your particles are different. Like, you make little particles when you walk around. It's stars because the moon is, you know... It was the first planet, so, like, being on a different planet on its own felt so magical when we unlocked the moon. Because it's like, whoa. The, the, like, I forget if I even knew we could go to a different place um, right when I bought this game. But just, like I said, going to the moon felt really cool. Cause like, it's not something you unlock, like, just... Oh, there's the moon people! See, I knew we would meet the moon people, and there's lots of astronauts. Little moon people and little moon cars. Can you imagine if, like, on Earth, everyone looked like planet Earths and drove in little Earth cars? Well, he's all- she's all twisty! He's all twisty. Yeah, things run from you and you try to eat them. I can't imagine why. Come here. Psst. He's not having that. So this is the moon. People ride on a giant golden koi. It's uh, it's a pretty chill place. Pretty chill. We got some moon trees that are pink. Moon mushrooms, which are also pink. We got a moon man robot man. Whee! I love the stretchy sounds. The sound effects in this game are so energetic and stuff. And we can eat the stars, of course, and poop them out. And there's always the music man, uh, the speaker peoples, and uh, they actually give you some Doppler effect. And there's this thing, whatever this is. It seems like a good excuse to get cut in half again, to be quite frank. So let's see if we can get that to happen. Um, boy. Hmm. I think I need to attach one end somewhere else. Hmm. <clears throat> yeah, your physics your the, the physics aren't quite perfect, as you can see here. So yeah, sometimes, instead of getting cut in half, you just phase through things. So that can be a little frustrating. Oh, there's a little, like, moon... vent spitting out moon gas, and there's, there's some, you know, good old-fashioned whatchamacallums. Astronaut people floating around. Alright, this one isn't too eventful. There's a nice purple mushroom, but yeah. Oh, golden clouds. Yeah, the, col the color of the ground, the clouds, the general aesthetics change with each planet. So you want to pay attention to, to all things like that. A lot of changes will be pretty obvious, but um, there's even stuff like... We'll, we'll see more bunker-shaped houses instead of the, like, the Japanese-shaped houses in uh, back on Earth. And sometimes you can see big globes of the uh, whatever planet you're on. The moon really isn't a planet, but in this game it is. The sun is also a planet in this game. I did not- we didn't even know. The, another thing is, we thought Pluto was gonna be the last planet for the longest time. And 
And then, come to find out at the very end, um, it, it, it's not. There's also, um, there's also another, uh, we go all the way back to the sun, then to Mercury and Venus. So we do visit the entire solar system. We thought Pluto was the end, and we were kind of amazed that it wasn't. And then we had no idea the letter happened either. Uh, when we found the letter, that was really, that was really amazing. Sometimes you get big, empty-ish fields like this. Is that the Cat Queen? Is that Mrs. Cat Queen? Is that- it's the Lion King and the Cat Queen, of course. My two favorite Disney movies, Do Not Steal. Uh, what, what, what are you? You- you have a hole in your face, and you have a long no- what- what- what is this man? Oh, oh, hold up, hold up. What- what is this? What is that? It looks like it's from Silent Hill. What is that thing? I don't feel safe anymore. I think this thing needs to die. What is this? What is that? What is it? I need to see your face. Stop moving. It's just got a... It made a horse noise. What is that thing? I think it pooped it into space. I think it's dead now. Oh, there's a bunch of different music in this game. Who was making that sound? We've got a pineapple explorer. Yeah, sometimes people's heads are fruit. Is that a kappa? Is that a kappa with a horribly like discolored face? Get out of here, kappa. Oh, we got we got we got a maid here. We got a cow maid. Does that does that satisfy your fetish? Is that you know? I'm not judging. I'm judging. We got little UFOs. Let's let's get on the UFO. Let's get on the UFO. Hit. What is that? What is that in the distance? I, I'm commandeering this UFO. Unfortunately, you can't actually drive any of the vehicles. The the NPCs can, and if you knock somebody out of an NPC, of a, what the hell are you? What is in? What is the hole in your face? It's freaking some sort of Cronenberg thing. This is very loud in my right ear right now. Why is that like Jesus dog? Hey Jesus dog, how you doing? Did you die for my sins today? Oh, it's a Jesus horse, excuse me. Very different Jesus. Here's, here's the good old Lion King. He's very large. He's got nice, like, jester pants going on. I love when my hat, the hair on my thing, hits the nose. Come on. Oh, is that a pyramid? It's a pyramid of like gold. What is this? Oh, it's a pyramid of stars. That is even better. Oh, it's like 50,000. So I thought it was just like big, long columns of stars, but oh, I'm so glad to have desecrated the sacred moon monument. Wow. You can find lots of cool stuff like that in this game. There's, there's just... You know, sometimes you'll find boring stuff, you know. It, it's fairly random. But there's some really cool stuff you can find. You can find the, the prince from Katamari. Um, you can find giant roving Katamaris everywhere. You can find... Um, well, you'll see a bunch of stuff in this playthrough. Let's take a look at another map or two, shall we? Maps like this. This is just tons of tiny little dudes. Get get on my back, Moon Man. Let's have a jamboree. Good old fashioned Moon Man jamboree. Yeah, people will get on your back if you. You might have seen that a little bit earlier. If you're long enough, people will crowd up on your back and and ride you along. I don't think we can get long enough. To, oh, look at that guy do that sidestep. Look at look at how distressed he is. Yeah, I'm gonna start eating him. Oh, I can't eat them. 
The ones on my back don't seem to care too much. I would have... I could have sworn I could eat things this big. I don't know. Sometimes the things you can eat don't make much sense. Oh well. Who knows? Can I take you with me? Can I take you with me when I go... Zoom out. There you go. In the house? Oh, I know they stay. Oh well. Oh wait, one of them stuck in there with me! Look at him! I guess you're coming along, bro. I like this rope. There's, oh, there's another kappa. This is like an entirely differently weird kappa, and I, I ate him. This is like Animal Crossing. This is a bunch of like it's just, it's a kappa city, on the moon. Totally normal. Why is the camera focused on my butt instead of my head? The camera sort of has its own mind sometimes. Uh, yeah, it's definitely focusing on my butt. I, I know it is a magnificent booty, but. Uh... Oh my gosh, the dog. I was speaking through a communicator. Did you hear that? Uh, don't you bulldoze me. Oh, wait, I'm forgetting. I, I was losing track of which head of which side of me was my head. Wait, is that Mario? Is that Mario? That's freaking Mario. You, can you can't tell me that's not Mario. It's freaking Mario the Kappa. I'm gonna eat him. I will devour you, sir. Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Have you heard the good word of being devoured? I will teach it to you. I think he's too big to be devoured. Yeah, he is. Alright, let's zoom out. Oh, and I like that the lamp posts are little moons. Yeah, those little robots. The, the swingy robots will show up on multiple planets. They have, like, different equipment all the time, too. Is that a space chimp? What is- what is that a sp that's a space chimp! I love that they speak through the communicators. These Kappas don't seem to require breathing apparatuses, though. Nor does Boy. Alright, probably the last one. Maybe. It's a, it's a vortex. These are fun. Oh, come on. Huh. It doesn't seem to take me up, but yeah, they spin you around. Speaking of spinning around, hello, weird trees. Oh man, I love these weird- It's the Frog Prince! Hey, Frog Prince, how you doing, my friend? We got a bunch of stars and we got starfish. You'll notice these levels do have sort of these themes within them. It is, you know, random exactly what you do get, but uh, it seems to select certain weightings for certain themes when it generates a level. Okay, one more at least. I love the chipmunk loading icon. I'm not sure why this different, like, it does the chipmunk, then it does this loading screen. Like, there's, there's multiple layers of loading. Sheep. That's even rarer than a black sheep. I'm gonna eat you. I'm, can I poop you directly into my house? I'm gonna poop it into space. Bye bye sheep. Wait, where do the sheep even go? Zoom, zoom out. There you go. Okay, I don't know. The sheep is just dead. I killed it. Who knows? Oh, it's Doug. Oh no, no, it's it, it's it's the green dude. It's Doug's rival. Anyway, he's dead now, too. <laughs> Actually, if they fall off the planet, they just fall in from the ceiling eventually. It's kind of silly. <gasps> penguin! Green penguin. Oh, I'm gonna eat this green penguin. Oh, there's a purple penguin. Is, there's some good planets here. Or good planets. Animals here. I don't think penguins can fly. Penguins can't fly! Penguins can't fly! I love going through these things. Oh, look at that horrifying watermelon face. Ugh. 
Don't be fooled, there'll be some terrifying things in this game too. <gasps> oh, it's that freaking thing. Okay, okay, we have to look at, oh, what the hell? What is it? What is it? Why is it allowed to exist? What? It, it, it's looking, it's looking at us. Oh, that's, I don't like this. Get, 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 it, get it off my screen. I don't. I, I, oh, 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 barfing sounds. I don't like that thing. Oh, is that is that a cowboy? Except it's literally a cow. Oh, that's that is fantastic, my friends. I'm eat it. There's some great physics when you eat things and like poop them out into space. I'm eat you too. You you are also terrifying. Sheep! Mr. Sheep! Mr. Sheep! Lots of different sheeps! It's like Minecraft with all the colored sheep. Alright, that's probably enough moon travel. We've seen we've seen a fair bit chunk of the moon, haven't we? 